Hello and welcome back to episode 6 of Link Between Worlds. This is the Tower of Hera. I was going to say, we're doing the Tower of Hera. But I couldn't remember if they still called it that or not. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Little change to them now. They, These little buggers will flip you around. Fuck you, turtle! Inexplicably evil turtles, aren't they? That wasn't your your internet papping out when the video cut off there. That was that was the uh, the emulator doing its best. I think if you look, these are also positioned in such a way that I think this one will ping me to the left. Yeah. And right, we've done a full loop. What have we learned? I can get up here certainly. And I can get outside. Look at this through the bars. And treasure immediately. Beautiful. Right, let's head back inside. All the way around here. Get to nowhere. Realise I should go this way. Thing is, I know in my heart often it does pay off going on those, let's call them long wall walks. Yep, push the wrong button there. I meant to merge in the wall. I just tried to swing my hammer at it. I like how girthy that hammer is. It's so satisfying. It looks like cartoonish, like something out of Who Framed Roger Rabbit. Look at that. That that is like a proper like show off clip, isn't it? That's that's the like. Oh, you think this is just regular Zelda? Boom! Check that out. Fucking just leapt up a room there. We're beyond the fourth wall at this point. And I must say, from playing this, whilst the 3D effect is useful for these situations, it's not needing, needed, meaning this game could easily have been brought to Switch. And whilst the original would look like pap, I can tell you, it's not that hard to upscale the graphics in such a way that it looks fine. Like this. Damn you, Nintendo. Take my money! I brought goddamn Twilight Princess HD on... Wii U for Christ's sake. Long after that, <laughs> well, I was going to say long after that, that console lost its relevance, but let's be honest, that console was never relevant. Right. Release the snakes. Wait for it. These make a really good noise when they go up and down. Listen to this, the snap. No idea how the technology works, so must be magic. It's the only option. Right, have we decided how we're getting up there yet? Is that the answer? Probably. Right, got my first key. Ah, shit. Didn't mean to do that. There's something over here in there. We, we all know it. Alright, there wasn't anything over there. I've, I've misjudged the situation. What felt like a kind of cheeky boundary break style maneuver is now a full on tactic in Zelda is to stand on those when you hit the switches. I thought, you know, I thought I'd missed it and I was going to have to wait ages, but then, then another handy dandy one comes along. Also, look, look, you can see the start, the entrance of the dungeon. I'd like to believe I could hop down and, and be out as like an easy maneuver. I know that's not the case though. Na 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 Hmm. Could probably latch onto that. Although I don't think I can. There we go. That's alright. I think if you... Is it going to go right? Yeah, I've, I think it just loops around back to the start, but there's, there's really no need. Hurry. Up. Damn it, go down! Ooh. Timing is everything. Now I can get on here, get even higher, and go around. But, don't really know what the... Oh, fuck me, there's a skeleton. Skeletons are weak to bludgeoning. Everyone knows that. Um, yeah, once I get the compass, I'll... I'll be more likely to come back to that area and experiment a bit, but yeah, I, no point I'm going nuts early on. Is there? I think there's one more. 
they're very cute, aren't they? They they made them a mu much cuter animal. They were they were somewhat slightly unpleasant before or metallic looking, but I I feel like they've gotten to cute. I'm okay with it. Ta-da! Wait, oh, this is just the upper level of where I just was. Meaning that had I gone exploring with uh, earlier on, this is probably all I would have come to. Which is fine. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Safe. What's this? What's this? Shit, what? Ah! It's okay, I didn't panic. That's the key. You know, in difficult situations in life, often... Only in panicking do you, do you make things worse. That's actually the shitty advice I always give give people. Like, if they're in a difficult situation, I always go, look, look don't panic. You yeah. <laughs> well, there's, there's no need to panic. What does I always say? Something like, there's no need to panic. Uh, it won't help. So it's something like that. It's the most unhelpful thing you can say. It's like, oh, just, look, just don't panic. Can offer you nothing beyond that, but right. So this will go up. Oh, there we go. Went up high. Good. Shit. It's all right. I can deal with this. I have the technology. You just don't panic. All right. Panic a little bit. All right. Come here. Do you stop when you get that? I oh, know you can hold it. It's good to know. That sort of hammer technique will come in handy. So far, weirdly, I've picked this up as being like my favourite weapon or item I've got. Wait, that was that was like the halfway mark of the of the dungeon. I mean, I'll take it. Little bastard. All right, fuck you. This is not a hammer-friendly enemy. You know, sometimes they are, sometimes they aren't. It was inadvisable to break that, but I put it to you that you wouldn't be able to resist it either. Alright. I was hopeful maybe I could do like extra damage, but it's fine. Okay, right. Now now we've gotten past that bit. Why well, had the compass all along? When did I get that? I guess I have. I, it didn't, I don't think it tells me anywhere I've got it, but I can see on my map it's telling me that there was, there was stuff. Um, right. I balls myself a little bit here. I knocked myself into a corner. I'm going to have to get rid of the hammer briefly. There we go. I'm pretty sure I need to fall down here. Yeah. Memory. Do you have it? Also, I can now see that there's clearly a treasure on uh, down here, which I'm betting I'll be able to see when I hit this. No. I go big, you know, smash out four, 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 four floor tiles all at once and drop through. Don't, don't cautiously knock one down and tiptoe in. Fucking dive head first. Some say it's a bad strategy. Those people are living in fear. Okay, right. Propel me. Good. Propel me. Now, I say. Good. Jump down and fall. I'm sure I won't live to regret this. Although saying that, I've got the thing that lets me teleport back to the start, so that's going to be less of an issue. Also, ah. Shit. Bad timing. I should have just kept going. It's clearly safety here. Um, right, so having done all of those puzzles and out the, the jumping and the timing and the platforming, to use the correct term, i got to do it again. Okay, it doesn't take my magic power to charge this. It's good to know. Well, it's not really charging it, it's just holding it. Ah, I bonesed it. I bonesed it. Double bozoed. I knew I actually had done that surprisingly well the first time. Wait, is this a... What is this? Oh, it's one of these. 
Huh. Okay. Fairy room down there. And a chest with money in it. Christ. The best day ever. Until I find out where it takes me. Yeah, that's fine. I thought it was going to be somewhere terrible. Right. Up we go. Ready. Go. Alright, that took a little bit longer than I thought. Shit, I fell. Well, I mean, I'll be honest, I did. I knew I'd need to fall at some point, so as long as that's the only time, yeah, there's no, no issue. I noticed Link doesn't take full damage. All the enemies do, just even a slight fall does, it just cripples them. Um, what am I actually doing up here? I think I have to light those up. Yeah, there right. does appear to be four of them. Ah, there we go. That brings in that. Don't come on here with me. Oh, good, they can't. Oh, I, th I thought this was going to move up again. But it's not that kind of a thing. Right, big chest up there. Not gonna lie, li little bit lazy. That end of the dungeon, they're like, "All right, here's the boss key. There's the door." There wasn't like a big in-between puzzle to get either. It's like, "Yeah, here's one. There's the other. Go for it." Now I could drop that down onto that platform and try and platform across, or money. Yeah. Both are good options, right? I've done this in like record time. It took longer to do the last dungeon. Maybe it was the very linear nature of it. Maybe it's me counting my chickens too soon because the dungeon isn't over yet. Or this is going to propel me. No. Nope. I thought this might shoot me directly into a boss fight. Which would have been cool. Oh, yeah, here it is. Hey, it's this guy. You remember him. Did he get an upgrade? Maybe. The very risky strategy I employ of charging this attack first on the assumption that it does more damage. Don't know if it does. Alright, let's hide behind here till he calms down a bit. Alright, he's calm. Alright, he doesn't actually... He doesn't propel you quite as much as he used to. There we go. I think he's dead. There's a chance there's a lot more going on. But... Uh, I think he's gone. I don't think he's coming back from that. Do all those spikes disappear? They should. Oh no, he's on this on this level. I've, I thought that the, the heart was lower down. Right. Well, that was slightly easy, wasn't it? So that's the uh, pendant of power. Is that what it's called? Pendant of power makes you feel well powerful. I could be a game writer, honestly. I could. I could write that level of text. Hey. My phone ringing. Hey, hey! You had done well, my young hero. You acquired the pendant of wisdom and the pendant of power. Now that you have all three pendants of virtue, you have proven yourself worthy of the master sword. You will find the blade deep within the lost woods. Go now, claim what is rightfully yours. Um, uh, right. Oh, fuck off. Stop trying to make me quit your game. It's too good. Um, I did just save it, didn't I? We'll also save it in the emulator. Uh, ring the bell. So I'm actually going to go back to... In fact, I'm not going to go to the village. I'm going to go to my house to start with. Because I left a pin in the map. And I'm pretty sure it was a pin to blow, blow up a bomb, bombable wall. But I just need to go and actually check that fact. It was... Oh, look, there's a thing up there. Um, I wonder, can I... Use this to get that down. 
No is the answer. I think you might need the sand rod for that. Or the ice rod. I think it's the ice rod, in fact. Um, but in a way that I can't do it yet. Yeah, that didn't help. It's fine. It's fine. I'll leave it for now. Uh, yeah, I put a pin in this wall, which I've already dealt with. So I can take that off. Ah, lovely. I don't know why I was so intent on doing that. This is not anything you can see in any fashion. <gasps> Treasure chest. Pick up this thing. I can't. Might just pop into the desert. I don't know if I can even get into the desert, honestly. It might only be accessible from the dark world. But I feel like I should have a look. I bet I can get me to the treasure chest, can't it? I like the fact that it goes into, like, weird kind of tinny music when you're in the wall. I don't know what it's supposed to mean when it does that. Like, what it implies. But I like it. Like, you're listening to a radio outside of a car. Um, yes, anyway. Definitely haven't been here before. I would remember this. No, I don't, I don't need to talk to this. Wait, do you just heal? I'm so out of touch with this game that I can't really remember anything anyone does. So there is a chance that she might have been... Yeah, fuck it, have more magic. It'd be a bit much just to have that in a random room with no cost at all. But you never know. You can't, you can't count on Nintendo to do anything too conventional, can you? So I could probably get around and get that money all right, but I'm not going to. Ring the bell. Go to Kakariko Village. The guy told me that I've got all the pieces now. But did he tell me what to do with them? Do I have to go back to him? Or do I just go to where I assume in the Lost Woods I'll find the Master Sword? I'll just go to the Lost Woods. There's bound to be a, a warp point or a save point. Or, well, both in there. Also, I can break into the well and taint the water. Oh god, there's snakes in here. I think I already knew this. I think, in fact, that's why the well is holed up, because of the snakes. I'm pretty sure I went through this exact series of events to learn this. Yes, a human heart. Oh, nice. The odds of me losing all my money in a catastrophic accident go down by the day. Fly, fly, chicken! Is there somewhere worth getting on top of? I can't actually remember. There was, it'll be. What? You again? You banged into me at the Zora Cave. Oh. Where do you go? Well. Not really relevant now. I'm getting distracted. I'm supposed to be going to recover the Master Sword, I think. Or something. I don't even know if I am going to be doing that. I'm doing it anyway. I'm going now. I'm going to the woods. You can't stop me. I'm taking the entrance I think I can get through. Ah, yeah, I'm unstoppable. There were no singing oh, squid things either. They haven't got the mist effect that they used to have, have they? Music's good, though. Music uh, feels reminiscent. I'm pretty sure eventually every single one of those pillars becomes an ac access point to the dark world. Lost words ahead, stay out. <laughs> Sign's not going to stop me. I don't read. Uh-oh. Hey, 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 welcome to the Lost Woods. These woods will trick you into going back the way you came. But all hope is not lost. If you can follow me, then you can walk a little deeper. Watch carefully. Okay. Ah, this is piss. Oh, God, that's not too difficult. Uh, well, he's... Uh, yeah, I see him. He's on the left. On the right. And now he's drifted up. I thought of a fun way that I can make that better for you to watch. Hmm. Okay. Maybe it'll do another dance here. Okay. Dance for me. Look, I can use the mouse. Oh, well done. That was fun, but now we're going to mislead you. Now two of us will bounce around. So don't follow the two of us. 
or you'll wind up back at the start. I think you can get it, right? But which one am I supposed to follow? Is it that one still? I don't... Or... Or am I meant to not... Was I meant to follow... I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know if this is right or not. But I'll know pretty soon. Yep, so I got that wrong. Uh, fuck it, it's a B. Yeah, I mean, I might as well have another go. Right. Yeah, yeah welcome to Lost Woods. Do you think you'll be the same every time? I wouldn't have thought so, but then again, they'd have to animate a new dance. Or would they? Yes, it wasn't. It was up last time, wasn't it? This time it's left. Was it? Was it down last time? Well, this is new. Screw you. Okay, let's properly listen. Oh, well done. That was fun, but now we're going to mislead you. Now, two of us will bounce around, so don't follow the two of... Don't follow the two of us. Okay, so I, I think I know what it is. I've, of the three entrances, those two are going to go into two of them. So I have, I have to keep an eye on both of those two now and uh, don't follow them. Right, so it's that one and the one up there. Right, so it's that one and the one down there. Glad I brought this mouse cursor. It's making life much easier. All right. So it's down. I gotta go down. Put a little trick there. He's kind of turned at the last minute. I suspect I've got to do one more of these. It's gonna be my assumption. Oh, very well done. Hmm. Guess it's time to really stump you. Now three of us will bounce around. Don't follow us. Think you can get it right? No. Right, so it's these three. It's still these three. It's, it's this one, and I've lost the other one entirely. Alright, so... Well, it's kind of 50-50. I, I know that I can't go up or right, and I lost track of the other ones. I think I'm going to guess left. Nope. I'm going to leave. I'm going to visit... Visit my friend, Sahaz, Sahaz, I don't. Do I need to get the Master Sword, or have I got to go to the castle first, or did I have to go to him and he tells me where to go? I, don't, I genuinely cannot remember what he said because I wasn't really listening. I cut across that. No. It's all right that I'm here now anyway because there's very clearly many things I could still attain. Such as whatever's behind this. It's going to be good, whatever it is. Probably treasure, like, uh, I don't know, a new cape or the Master Sword. That's where I would keep it. Trap, trap, trap. That one's a trap. Fuck you. Those things terrify me. T sorry, those things used to terrify me. I still do, but they used to as well. Ah, oh, it's a shortcut. Huh. Cool. Um, I might as well save it while I'm here. No sense not. Okay. Um, yeah, obviously the money doesn't respawn, but the enemy does. Not sure what use that shortcut will be to be in the future, but who's to say? I'm going to talk to him, then I'm going to go back there and get all those chests. Oh. This isn't, this isn't where that guy lives, is it? I think he might live in the village, and I, I just went here. Oh, well, still. It's Grave Robber. Now, nah, how's all this going to work? This place has so many levels. Time for some three-dimensional thinking. So once that's done, sure, that treasure will be mine. Yeah, I'm sure. Um... I already know what I have to do. This is inherently a, sort of the latter puzzle of the Tower of Hera, I'm pretty sure. You have to do this, then this. Then, then be careful not to overextend your magical abilities. Okay, this hasn't worked. Oh, 
Okay. Let's think about this. Merge. Wrap around. Climb up there. Now jump off. I feel like I somehow knew to do that but failed. Well, that was embarrassing. <laughs> Just walked off the edge. Glad it put me back where it did. Merge with that. Jump across to that. Go back around to there is my safety. And I'm here. Now I think there's either one or two hundred rupees in these sort of treasure chambers. Here's a 100. For some reason, I I knew it was one of those big silver ones, but equally, I just, I thought it was 200 rupees. Uh, yep. Okay. Well, I didn't mean to come here, but it's worked out. I'm going to grab the hook shot. Ready? Na, 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 na. The speed and effortlessness. Of which he does that. Always impressive. I hear squeaking about. A squeaking and a squeaking. The potential for shenanigans is high. Red rupee? Not worth it. Um, right, so I can hookshot across to that, I'm guessing. There's, oh, look, there's a, one of these things here. I've unintentionally started just collecting stuff. It's fine. Um, anything around there to worry about? Probably not. Oh, look, there's a thing up there. No. Can't really remember how to get that off. Uh, hook shot is the thing that immediately makes the most sense. The only thing is, I can't 100% remember that a hookshot exists in this game. Uh, not a hookshot, a Pegasus boots. Yeah, the old go faster sprinty sprints. I'm going to take this rock with me. I'm going to throw it at this thing when it comes alive. Way more effective than I thought that would be, honestly. I didn't think that would work in anywhere near the amount that it did. I'm thinking fairies in there, or maybe just a straight trip treasure room. Oh, no. Dark and full of snakes, and very clearly, a heart piece. As beyond expectations. Fuck you. Must go and figure out what these monster guts do as well. I, I'm pretty sure they're nothing that useful. Alright, what have I got? Bomb. I was expecting not the bomb. <laughs> How many times can I get away with doing it to that that to that guy? I, I can't walk across here. I've come back all, all the way back up here for nothing. Uh, uh, what a waste of my time. You know what? I'm just going to teleport back here because this is where I want to be anyway. And this will this will get me what I need. Get me where I'm going. I just want to open these chests that I accidentally walked past a few minutes ago. Um, how do I get to them? Well, that one I hookshot to. That's easy. Though if I hookshot to it... Yep. Not my proudest moment. Get me there. 20 rupees. Nothing to shy at. Right, and then there was... Got the thing down there, alright. Well, might as well get these. Hmm, all real. What are the odds? I suppose it's not really an odd-spaced thing, is it? Uh, that's just the way in. Some rupees up there. Been up here already. I know this isn't actually anything I need to worry about. Got that chest. Ah, chest there. So I get to that by running around that wall up there. And then 
Was there one more chest other than that one, or was that it? That might have been it. I'll go to the right level, so I'll be able to go back. 100 rupees for that. Cheeky. I think I've already made back all of the money and more that I spent to get all of these items. So it was 100% worth just buying every single one as soon as I could. I don't think you lose rupees when you die. Anyway, I'm, I'm going to save it there. Having utterly failed to talk to the old man. Uh, yep, so that was uh, episode 6. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.